drumming, okay, uh, when you learn a guitar, it just, it's all impossible. And that's because you've got muscles that you've not used in the way that you're going to have to in order to play guitar. And it's just all very difficult. And so the first tip really I can give anybody is practice. I know that sounds stupid. But what I mean by that is pick up your guitar at least once a day, at least for a few moments. I mean, for 10 minutes. And if all you can muster is to hold down some sort of chord, I mean, the chord I normally start people off with is E minor, which is just these two strings. And if you fret them and it sounds like that. Don't worry about it, just keep playing it because after a while they will begin to work and um, you'll suddenly find it you're getting a nice sound. when you strum and when you don't. So you might be strumming on the downbeat or on the upbeat. And so this is a, um, a snippet from Lola by the Kinks. So just that strumming and then, then it goes all picky and da 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 da. I'll go in there, just the strumming bit. Even, you'll notice, even after all these years, um, and I've been playing, goodness me, um, I can't, for 40 years, goodness me, I can't believe that, I only feel like I'm 17 on the inside, so I don't know how that's possible, but anyway. So you just get that little bit, bit of a bounce, sometimes it's, it's sort of what you might call vestigial, Ooh, that's a clever word, isn't it? But you know, just the merest hint of a bounce. But it just keeps you in that rhythm, it just keeps the rhythm alive. If you just get that, just that steady thing going. So, so I'm just bring it down and then two bounces. Then, so that bit you're strumming every time. So. So it's just a, a, a point, and it's not I'm trying to teach you that particular song, but just you know, just keep that bounce going, and you'll find it will do your rhythm down into good. So happy strumming. <laughs>